I want to take this off and actually add a light to where the vent fan is. The vent hood is kind of in the way when you're cooking because it sticks out so far and it's not very bright. And actually the fantastic fan is right in the middle of the rig so it does just about everything we need it to do and it works better than this. There should be only about like six or eight screws I believe just to take it out. And it does have a little caulking on there but we can take care of that. Let's get to go. Before I start work on it, the thing you need to remember is either disconnect your battery so you don't get electrocuted or you need to turn off the breaker to the vent hood area. That way we don't get a when we're working with wires. This is where our battery is located and we have a quick disconnect on our battery. So all I have to do is unplug this. We do have a paper towel holder that is like screwed into the side of the vent hood and I'm going to take that off first. Thinking we need to take the actual vent fan off first because that's where the light is wired in and tape off those wires and then I can remove the rest of the vent hood. I wanted to take the fan off and get the wires clipped before I took this off so it wouldn't be such a hassle to get everything off. So part one is down. There were four screws for the fan itself and I think it's just uh, four longer screws for the vent hood as far as I can tell. So let's get those screws out. Finally got these four darn screws out. One of them was stripped and it was a struggle to get out, but we finally got it out. Now, this thing is still in there pretty solid, but I think once we start uh, cutting around the edge of it, because they caught all around it, I think once I get some of that off, we'll be able to take this sucker down. I'm gonna cut this caulk seal right here. Oh, there it goes. I think it's ready to come off, come on. Voila! <laughs> and the vent fan is gone. Look at how open it feels. I don't have to do like this to cook now. Can't wait to get it all prettified. The hard part is done. We got the vent hood off. Now we're going to find a light fixture that we want and I want to do something with this back here. I'm thinking about maybe putting up a backsplash and some kind of spice rack maybe. Phase one is done, stay tuned, and we'll show you what's next. So we have this piece of board we're trying to cover up where the vent hood vented out to the outside and it's not square and everything, but that looks pretty good to me. Ace and I got some peel and stick tiles from Amazon to kind of go with our colors that we're going with with the floor and curtains and stuff and we've already got a couple of pieces on I'm really liking it and it's time to cut this down to size and finish it up what do you guys think we are installing the light where the vent hood was forward is one light backward is two lights I think the hood ectomy is done. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. This is Amanda reminding you to keep soaring to the end.